Oh, yes. Ah, another one of those. Old guys. Yes. I believe in caves for some reason. Yeah. This character design is actually the same as Savage Hall, as, uh, as you probably noticed. Yes. Go find a piece of heart. People were too lazy to draw separate sprites back then. Yeah. Well, uh, that and there might have been memory limitations, I don't know. Perhaps. Oh well. Memory limitations on the Super Nintendo. Mm -hmm. Well, the game is actually pretty big, so... I don't know, what, what is the maximum limit of a Super Nintendo cartridge? Cartridge. Cartridge, sorry. Is there a... Hell if I know. Is there a game that actually pushes NES to its limits? Uh... Yes, and yes, whatever you want to call it. I don't know, I... Uh, not really that knowledgeable on Super Nintendo games since I never owned one. Never owned one? What the... Secret room. I need to How did you lift that thing? Uh, well, as, l as long as it isn't a Blackstone Link can lift anything. Oh. With the Polo Glove. Oh, that... Oh, right, right, you're right. By the way, as you can see right who's now... The, who's this guy, by the way? The Ultimate Warrior? It's a thief. Oh. As you can see right now, he's actually wearing the Polo Gloves. Look at his sprites. Oh, hands. yeah. Yeah, I forgot you picked that up, but I didn't even know what the hell it was for anyway. Well, now we can lift uh, all these rocks. Oh, so, yeah. No matter the size, but the black ones, they're heavier. Yeah. So we need the golden glove to lift those. Oh, yeah. And Link's Awakening was a bracelet. Uh, the bracelet? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I remember. Crap, get boobies. Link smash! Uh, sorry, I have to check the map really fast. What's the fastest route? That's oh, okay. I guess it's through Kakariko Village. Isn't it Kakariko Village? Whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Tomato, tomato. <laughs> oh. I am Doctor Strange, not weird. Well, there is a Doctor Weird as well, but he's not with Marvel Comics. Nice. Oh, maybe I should pick up the, the bug catching net so I can get those guys. The good bees? Well, they're actually evil bees. Oh, yeah, there is a... Oh, so there is a good bee as well. Yeah, I read that somewhere once. Yeah, as soon as you pick them up with the bug catching net and you capture them in a jar and release them, they are good bees. Ah. And you can uh, sell those for money, right? Uh, I don't think you can sell anything in this game. Can't? No. Oh. It's, uh, uh, uh... Can you actually sell anything in Zelda games? I'm not really sure, but I think I read somewhere once that you could sell the good beats for money. I didn't even know you could sell anything in the game. Ah, oh, well. It was not, a long time ago, and uh, yeah. Not, not like I need the money anyway, I've got more than 500 rupees right now. True enough. This part. I don't know who you are, but if you're going to the mountains, will you take me with you? A strange old guy just trusts you like that. Well, of course, you're a friendly looking youngster. Your friendly neighborhood link. Yes. Blah, blah, blah. Gee, I wonder if that is of any importance to the plot, what he was just saying. Well, it kind of was. It was about the kidnapping of the maidens and stuff like that. Oh well, yeah, I figured as much. As long as the guy is behind, Holder. I can't even run. Look at this. It's like I'm fidgeting Then don't forward. bother, just run. Give me my mirror. Alright. We're going to skip the ball apart, because that's annoying, and we're also going to fill up our hearts. See? You will need the moon pearl. Well, but. yeah, I didn't uh, get it uh, before I went into the dark world. Well, you actually go into the dark world once before getting it, but then it's not a problem. When, when you, once you enter it the second time, you're stuck in the rabbit form. No matter yeah, the, yeah. The, fir the, the first time you need to use the mirror, right? Yep. Okay. It's the mirror is always needed to mm. 
turn from the dark world to the light world. I'm not sure if I even have the mirror, but yeah, but, uh, it was a long time ago, so... Well, you can't even come, at, uh, come to this point without the mirror. The guy will uh, immediately gives it to you once you get out of the caves, and you have to take him with you. Yeah. So, you can't even get rid of it. Oh well. This really scared the crap out of me the first time I saw it. Oh yeah, this is it. Let's get to the mirror. Yeah, he's playing football with the yeah, soccer yeah. with the other guy. And then we're back to Link. I see. Now we get a piece of heart. Actually, the Moon Pearl is one of the most missable items in the game. You can see the big chest, but you can't really reach it immediately. You have to fall there from another floor in order to get to it. Uh -huh. So that's what I, why a lot of people miss it the first time going to the game. I don't think I ever went in here uh, either. I think I just stepped on that thing like you just did, got into the dark world, and then couldn't figure out what the hell I was supposed to do anymore. Uh. Well, as you probably yeah. have seen, the dark world changes some elements of the yeah of the light world, like the like the spectacle uh, spectacle rock. The what? Spectacle rock. It's the where it just got the heart container. Uh, that piece of heart, I mean. Uh, I'm gonna show you when I'm out of the dungeon. Yeah, okay. Uh, instead of a rock, it's just a... Uh, it's just a... God, I'm messing this up. It happens. God, come on! <laughs> I remember you fought a... Fought one of the one of those guys, but was really huge as a boss in Link's Awakening. Hmm. Oh well, a mini boss actually. It was a mini boss? I thought he was the first boss that uh, you explore, uh, encounter. So that could be. Yeah, it's been a while since I played Link's Awakening. Well, well, I'm playing it right now. And, well, not right now, but I'm playing it on Game Boy. Yeah, I got it. I got my hands on a copy of it, so I'm trying to finish it right now. Let's see. Some of other games always get my attention first. Yeah, me too. Like right now, I'm also playing 3D dot game heroes. Ah, yeah. <laughs> and getting really annoyed by it. Yes, it is annoying. Ah! And this isn't going very well either right now. Ah. This usually never happens. Seriously. Yeah, I guess I am a bad luck charm after all. Like Is there such a thing, a bad luck charm? Well, it would be a bad luck thing, but not a charm. Thing. A yeah. charm is more like good luck. Yeah, that's a bit of an oxymoron. Like I said, this is the part where they prevent you from standing in the door opening and doing this easy way. Yeah. It's pretty annoying. Well, they still form, uh, form the same familiar pattern, so... Yes, but... But... It's still annoying to figure out which is the next one. I mean, the pattern is built up the same way, but it's still random. Yeah, I guess. And we can continue. Oh, well, not that hard. Nah. Well, says the person who is just sitting here watching <laughs> you play. <laughs> You should try the game on, uh, for yourself, now that you've seen how to continue, but... Yeah, I probably should. Like I said, I uh, should probably just play the entire series uh, now. You know what's annoying about these guys? What? Once they jump out of the way, they throw a bone at you. you. The other ones don't do that. Yeah, they, these have red skulls. So that means they're enemies of Captain America. Now we found the big key. Well done. The key is always the same, yet never usable in two different dungeons. Yep, interchangeable antimatter keys. It's a trope. Ah! Oh, yeah. I was wondering how you were gonna get out of that one. Uh, they went really far into some dungeons with this switch system. At some point, even giving you a switch so you can go from point A to B very easily, 
but then once you're at point C, you, find, you figure out that you need to go back, flip the switch, and do the entire part over again. Yeah. And those guys up there, those are the, uh, the dongles, right? Uh, actually, I don't know. That tiny to be a dongle. The dongle was bigger. Well, they were uh, they were that tiny in the original NES game as well, right? Uh, no, they were actually, I think, twice the size of Link. Could be. Whatever. And the first dongle you meet was a boss, ah. which is like smoke. Yeah, 